Well, it has been a beautiful Saturday out there. We've been sunny today, but we've still been a little cool with temperatures in the middle to upper 60s. We did have that cold front push through our area this past week. That is now pushed off of the east coast there. It's actually bringing a little bit of snow to portions of Maine, Vermont, and New Hampshire on this Saturday. But here for us, we are sunny and in the 60s. And then as we go into your Sunday, we're actually going to warm up into the upper 70s before a cold front comes through Sunday afternoon into the evening hours. Since that front is approaching our area, our winds will be gusty for your Sunday gusts and upwards of 20 miles an hour for Sunday. Now, once that cold front pushes through early Monday morning, we will see those winds shift out of the northeast, and that's going to usher in just a little bit of cooler air, though. We will stay warm for Monday with highs in the 70s and sh abundant sunshine across the area. But for tonight, we will drop down to close to average around the upper 40s to lower 50s out there. And then as we move into your Sunday, it's going to get warm, if not hot for some of you. Uh, we're looking at highs in the upper 70s to lower 80s across the region. Those winds are going to be gusty out of the west, northwest, thanks to that front approaching our area tomorrow. But not to worry, it is going to be dry, so rain chances are going to remain at zero for your Sunday. Now, that's not going to be the case if you're headed out trick-or-treating for Wednesday night. We are going to see that cold, another cold front move across our area, bringing us some showers and storms Wednesday night. Temperatures are going to be in the middle to upper 60s out there, but you're definitely going to need an umbrella and a raincoat as you head out the door to go trick-or-treating for your Wednesday night. But after that cold front moves through Wednesday and Thursday, we're going to stay dry and cool for next weekend. And over the next seven days, that's really the only rain chances we have there. Some of us could see between a half and a full inch of rainfall out of the system on Wednesday and Thursday. But before that rain gets here, we're going to get hot up into the 80s for Sunday and Tuesday. But once that cold front pushes through Sunday afternoon, we will be a little bit cooler on Monday with a high of 73.